Now it's time for question time with Mr. Monkey. <laughs> so, Mr. Monkey, do you have a girlfriend? Why? I can't quite say I have a girlfriend, but I do have a life partner. My name's Gina! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Monkey, are you a guy or a girl? Well, I like to say that I'm androgynous. You know, can't tell what sex I am, see? <laughs> well, that might be a little misleading. Let me try that again. So, yes, I would say I'm androgynous. Like, like Elmo or, or Jesus Christ. Mr. Monkey, why are you not made for children under three? Well, I'm not made for children under three, as indicated by my tag, y'all. Because uh, sometimes I tend to do some things to said children that their parents might not like. If you give it up, say it. Would you please elaborate? Well, sometimes I like to put this. In very, very specific places. And that's all I'm at liberty to discuss. It's true. <laughs> See? Even Gina verifies. Kinky. Gina just turned four. <laughs> Mr. Monkey, is it true that you, Michael Jackson, a spare tire, two slabs of bacon, and a blind Harry Potter lookalike named George had... Relations? Well, as far as Michael Jackson is concerned, us and those children under three had a marvelous time. The spare tire, however, I never go near it anymore. I never had relations, but one time, it did. It did try to touch me. <laughs> I'll never go there again, to that playground, that tire swing. That blind Harry Potter looked like. Well, of course I had relations. He was blind! What great opportunity to take advantage of him! I feel bad, but... Oh well. And that other? What was that other? Two slabs of bacon. Oh yes, the two slabs of bacon. I called them Marsha and Gil. Marsha was particularly fatty. I remember, I remember quite well. But Gil, he was, he was too skinny. We had to throw him out in the middle of the, of the switch, you see. Anything else? Mr. Monkey, what's your favorite ringtone? Oh, well, uh, I'll have it. I'll have it played for you. Hold on, let me, let me go over to my, to my telephone. Go, Jada. Go, Jada, go. Yes, bitches. I party like rockstar. I party like a motherfucking rockstar. Stop it, Jana. That's enough. Jana likes that song. She can't very well articulate it because she's only four. But she likes that song. Anything else, sir? Mr. Monkey, what's your favorite brand of lipstick? Well, I tend to like Maybelline. Because Maybelline's got that slick and shine where you put on the color, and then you put on the gloss coat. Janet, do you like my Maybelline? Ugh! Yes, Janet, <laughs> come kiss my Maybelline, Janet. <laughs> oh! Fucking love Janet. <laughs> I love Janet so much. I can't get enough Janet! Oh, shit. That's no one, Janna. Get away. It's Get cute. away, erectile dysfunction. I love Janna. Not erectile dysfunction. Do you understand erectile dysfunction? Last question. Pick a word. Jello or marmalade? Ooh, jello. Jello so nice and, and jiggly. Kind of reminds me of Michael Jackson and those three-year-olds. One time. 
One time, my dad, in my teeny, teeny, tiny little pool I used to have as a child, he put jello in it. And I thought, well, shit, there's jello in my pool. <laughs> so then, I decided that if I pee in the pool, <laughs> since the jello was blue, of course, that I could experiment with color. So I peed in the pool. Not pity the pool. I peed in the pool. And then it turned green. And I was like, shit! I'm like, Einstein! I've discovered Blello! Yes. Blello. Oh, yes, bitch, I went there. Anything else? Mr. Monkey. Why were you made in China? Well, when my parents, Mr. and Mrs. Monkey, were just tiny little monkey fuckers, they took a trip to China to find a better living at the Nike factories. And then, one day, they decided that they should, they should procreate. They should procreate real nice. You see, my mother was a dark-skinned monkey, as you could tell by the lower half of my face. And my father was a light-skinned monkey, as you could tell from the upper half of my face. And so they procreated in China. And that's why I was made there. Yes. Anything else? Why is there a purple flower next to you, Mr. Monkey? Well, shit, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. That's the end of our questions. Thank you. It's been a pleasure.